G'day guys, welcome back, episode 4. Today we are pouring the backyard plain concrete and exposed egg in the front. Let's get the trucks warmed up and get into it. I don't think that'd come undone because they're all frozen. <laughs> Watch out. That's not far off being spot on, Fuzz. You just gotta square it up. Back at that wall end a little bit. Tiny bit more. Yep. Just squeeze the foam. See there where it's peeling a bit? Nah, here. Yeah. Go back a bit, Henry, and dump it. We'll just do it with Kong fast. Yep, go back a bit. Yep, there, go. Just grab that yellow. In, grab that yellow cap out of there. Nice Henry, grab that yellow cap. This is like the best angle, boys, with all the steam. Thanks. Look at it, Fuzz. Look at the steam of everyone. <laughs> Come back a little. Send it. Nice and slow, mate. Try to get that fascia going there, boys, so Rob can screw. Thank you, boss. Just go for it.
clear line. And just don't make that steel bit to deep enough. Edge eats the same every time. Yeah, we see the edge is a bit sunk at that end, Rob. Just build it up a tiny bit. What end? See at the timber end? Right where you are, see how the timber. Yeah, just put a bit of slurry there, build it up a little. Just a little tip with the edging, guys. We always run our first cut straight away. That way, as the concrete cures, it all goes off together. And you will always hit it again when you're finishing. But the benefit of hitting it straight away is it doesn't bleed up. If you do wait a short amount of time, like 15 minutes, and then edge it, it will bleed and be a lot wetter than the rest when it comes time to finish. And then you will get different colours and just ends up not being as even. So always try to hit that first cut straight away. You're still hungry? Yeah. Didn't you just have a zinger, Rob? You're a machine. That was an action shot, mate.
Zahn. Juck. Pampe. Nein. Pampe Zahn. So through winter, guys, we generally always wash the next day. Through summer, we can wash the same day, but Melbourne's just too cold through winter. So we'll always spray the chemical when it's pretty firm and come back the next day and it's still soft as butter. And same goes with the saw cutting, so always second day we'll saw cut it in winter and the next day we'll saw cut it in summer. Come out really good. Everything's nice and neat. You're gonna tile the deck there, so it's a slight step down at the moment. Tile the porch. Clearly gonna edit that out. All right, guys. It was quite cold last night, so I came back to check on the sealer. No cloudiness, so it's good to go. If you need help or want to ask anything, guys, feel free to ask us in the comments. We're here to help. Have a great week. God bless, and we'll see you on the next one.